Rise of the Machines. Now, CES 2026 felt a bit like a sci-fi film. Humanoids and robots were everywhere. Ajibot, the robot that gained so much fame for walking 100 kilometers earlier in the year, was displayed. So was Boston Dynamics Atlas, which wowed audiences with its dexterity and mobility. Now, robots and humanoids have always been part of CES, but what made 2026 different was that these were not some big concept robots. These were robots that have already been deployed in the real world. The halls of CES 2026 in Las Vegas were buzzing with movement. Humanoid robots turned corners with human-like grace. AI companions engaged visitors in conversation. And machines on wheels went gliding through the cloud with an almost playful intelligence. The difference this year was that robots didn't represent a vague possibility in the future. They represented what's possible today. The robots and humanoids we saw at CES weren't concepts. They are being deployed in the real world as we speak. Here are the ones that really caught our imagination. Now, Agibot got everyone's attention long before CES. Ubitex Humanoid made headlines when it set a new benchmark for robotic endurance by completing an incredible 3-day 100km walk in late 2025. Not surprisingly, Agibot was the cynosure of all eyes at CES as crowds thronged to get a closer look at Agibot's autonomous navigation systems that allow it to balance, adapt to terrain and interact with physical environments like a human. Unitree Robotics R1 is, as its makers like to say, born for sport. The R1 weighs 25 kilograms, stands at just over 4 feet tall and responds to voice commands. It can walk, run and even do handstands. The R1 has 26 movable joints and an open software that allows developers to customize movements and functions. But more than physical abilities, it's the robots that have been designed to provide emotional sustenance that really created waves at CES. And right on top was Kokomo, described by its maker, Japan-based Ludens AI, as an AI companion robot. Kokomo doesn't have any fixed programmed responses to stimuli and actually learns and evolves with every interaction. All over the world, people need companions. For now and uh, uh, with large language models, the robot could become re uh, could become really interesting. But I think with the current technology, uh, the robot could do the same as uh, the real pet. The robot uses large language models and memory systems to learn from daily conversations. Now, if dogs are a man's best friends, then Jenny has big shoes to fill. Created by a US-based company Tombot, Jenny is a lifelike Labrador designed to provide companionship to people who cannot care for a real pet. Jenny has multiple sensors that allow it to respond to touch and voice, move and react in ways that mimic a real animal. The company says the goal is to offer emotional support, especially to elderly users and those with cognitive disabilities. And finally, Suikar. It isn't lifelike like Jenny, but is designed as a pocket-sized pet. The device emerges from an egg-style casing and grows to develop a personality unique to each owner. Suikar is the world's first AI pocket pet that can physically, truly grow up with you. Owners can feed Suikar, play with it and watch as it learns, remembers and adapts. Thanks to a built-in AI memory and personality system. Suikar is capable of adjusting its behavior based on how it's treated, creating a sense of a living, responsive companion. From the emotional to the practical, the classic sci-fi depiction of a robot has been either on a battlefield or as a household aid. Cloyd is taking the latter route and showed off its chops at CES 2026. The robot is built to handle household tasks such as folding laundry, doing the dishes and kitchen prep. Here at CES 2026, Cloyd 
the, the new AI-enabled robot from LG Electronics is making its debut. This is really the result of seven years of research and commercialization of a wide range of robots for industrial and commercial purposes, now showing the future of robotics in the home. Cloyd uses articulated arms, multi-jointed hands, and autonomous navigation to move and work around the home. This one got all the casino owners in a bind. It is Las Vegas after all, and the idea of an unflappable croupier has real-world use here. Robotics company Sharpa unveiled a robot capable of dealing cards at a blackjack table using AI and sensors. The robot recognizes cards and even interacts with players during the game. Now, can it catch players who count cards? The manufacturers didn't say. We're in Vegas, so we wanted to have something that resonates with, uh, with a mood of uh, CES, obviously. But uh, actually, dealing cards is pretty difficult for a robot. So you see that it needs to manipulate an object that is flexible and thin. It's quite difficult and it does it pretty well. So this highlights the dexterity of our heads. But not only that, it needs to think through what's happening in the game and make decisions. So it also highlights the reasoning ability and the AI capabilities that we have to make you know, robots interact with people and accomplish actions. And finally, in the flesh, Engine AI Robotics controversial robot that created waves for displaying its martial arts movements recently was showcased along with its sibling, the lightweight PM01. The demonstration is kind of like uh, to demonstrate how strong and uh, how reliable this robot is. And uh, we are open source this robot, so that means a lot of uh, secondary applications uh, where the, the solution provider can based on what we provide and to uh, to add on the application. The PM01 is a lightweight version aimed at scale deployment in commercial settings, making humanoid robots more accessible for daily operations. Both robots combine AI, autonomy and precision to reduce manual workload, improve efficiency and interact safely with people in real time. And finally, a real robot with superhuman strength. Unsurprisingly named Atlas from Boston Dynamics, capable of lifting seriously heavy weights, has been designed to take on risky and physically demanding work. As you can see, Atlas here has joints that can move 360 degrees. This lets Atlas move even more efficiently than humans, particularly in manufacturing environments where every second counts. I can confidently say that this product version of Atlas is the best an actually simplest robot that we have ever built. All in all, CES 2026 will be remembered as the year of the humanoid. The robots invaded the tech show and showed us a glimpse not of the distant future, but what a world inhabited by humans and humanoids could look like as soon as 2026.